So we're back here at what, storage unit number three? Yes, finishing up number three. And I was moving the shoes. Yes, as I was loading some stuff out of the truck. I got them out of the way to find that. What is that? That would be a lockbox. <gasps> a safe, a century safe, huh? Yep. And those are easy to break. Yep. Is it locked? I don't know yet. I haven't touched it. So you don't even know if there's anything in it? Nope. I literally saw it. Oh my goodness. It's heavy? Yes, it is. And there's no key? No key. No way of opening it without the key. Let's go teach Miss J how to open a sentry safe. Right now? Right now. Why not? Hi. You want to learn how to open one of these lock boxes? Sure. All right. Let's okay, here goes. So I'm afraid there's a firearm in here with the way the unit looks. I'll give it my finger. <laughs> and so we're not going to throw it until the last resort. If I, hit it. I think we should just throw it. I don't know. That's not gonna work. <laughs> she has a handlebar or something in her hands. What is in there? Did you open it seriously? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Jay, will you take this over there? Done. And done. Ready? We, I saw some things, though, that might not be able to show. All right. Maybe pan away for just for a second, Jay. Pan away. Okay. So, go ahead. We have some personal information. More personal information. Lots of needles. Lots of IDs. Red solo cups. A partier. Here's a diamond receipt. No price. That's weird. A Superman watch. He really treasures these. Look. Actual pills. Oh my god, is that needle be full? With that. Yeah. And there's a nickel. Yeah. I'm just gonna close this back up. Aww. But you can break open a safe with a handlebar to a bike. <laughs> well, century safes, man. <laughs> so I found this bag. And we're gonna have to take it into Bambi if it finds that shine. Because they're stamped 925. Oh, yeah, that's so freaking awesome. We'll have her check them out. I mean, we could, but with our test circuit we just got, we're just going to take them into her and see what she thinks. There's something else on there, too. 925, and then there's this. Jake, can you read what that says? You see it? Where? <laughs> <laughs> right here next to the 925. There's like a circle with something in it. You take this? No. Yeah, I can't tell. All right, guys. I just woke up. It's bright and early. I haven't brushed my hair, washed my face, nothing. And we have to go and load this last storage unit, our third one. This will be our third trip doing the third one. We have until 11.22 a.m., so... We're gonna drink our coffee and hit the road. Okay, so I totally forgot the key at home. So we had to use the crowbar to get the lock off. But, so our conversation was fun on the way here. What were we talking about, Alexis? <laughs> about car compactors that crush spiders. What? They what was your conversation about? Hold on, hold on. I, I mean, the smaller it's ones were like fruits and stuff. I there's like little holes and all the guts would come pushing up. That's Remind me of when I saw the Skittles doing it. Was your conversation that interesting? 
don't, our, no, I don't think our conversation was that interesting at all. <laughs> Great. We got our Dutch. Let's finish unloading the storage unit. We only have until 11.22, so we're going to bust the move and load it. If we find anything really interesting, we'll show it. Otherwise, we're going to go through when we get home. So, we got records, but it's a sad day for Minnie Mouse. Oh, But we've got tons and tons and tons of Minnie Mouse and Mickey Mouse stuff. Disney stuff everywhere. The back of this unit is just covered in Disney stuff. All right, it's empty. Even got all the weird stuff that they were storing up there. We just found a message in a bottle. Don't sniff it. Why? I can't reach. Ow. I don't think I'm going to be able to get it out. Let's get tweezers. Ew, it smells. Stop smelling <laughs> stuff. <laughs> okay. You're not human. Oh, this is a conversation. Aww. Okay. I'm sorry for the things I do and say, but it, it's things I truly feel. I'm at the point where I'm about to really be alone out here, and I, and it really does scare the sh